Hello! In this tutorial, I'll show you how to cancel Otter AI transcription. So here's a detailed guide on how to cancel your Otter AI subscription. The first thing you like to do is to log into your Otter AI account. So visit the Otter AI official website and log in using your account credentials. Once logged in successfully, it will take you to this home page. On the home page, go ahead and click on your profile name in the top left corner of the navigation menu. And a drop down menu will appear, including upgrade plan, account settings, refer and end, help center, contact support, and logout. Go ahead and click on account settings from the drop down menu. After entering the account settings page, you'll see several tabs at the top general meetings plan apps notifications and security go ahead and click on the plan tab to view details about your current auto ai subscription in the plan section you'll see your current subscription plan type example auto basic auto pro auto business or auto enterprise now scroll down to the bottom of this section where you'll find the option to cancel subscription click on the trans the cancel subscription button cancel subscription button click on it then a confirmation prompt to appear asking if you're sure you want to cancel the subscription confirm your cancellation by clicking yes or confirm if you're on a trial or annual plan auto ai may offer you a chance to downgrade or switch to another plan but you can proceed with the cancellation after successfully canceling auto ai will send you a confirmation email the email will confirm that your subscription has been cancelled and may also include information about when your subscription will end. To ensure that your subscription has been cancelled, you can check your plan section in your account settings. Your plan should now show as free or reflect the change you made. Now, depending on the subscription type, monthly or annual, you may be eligible for a refund. Alta AI typically offers refunds for cancellation made within a certain time frame. But it is important to check their refund policy or contact support. After cancelling, you will still have access to your current subscription benefits until the end of your billing cycle. So once the billing cycle ends, your account will revert to the free tier. Now go over the tutorial from the top to the bottom to get acquainted with the steps. And once you're done, you begin to go. I hope this tutorial marvelously helped you search.